I don't want to miss nothing, baby. I got to give y'all all the teeth. Lip gloss always got to be popping. Did I get my teeth done? Baby. And they be like, oh, I love your hair. The baby hair is stepping. Ah, I can't believe I'm exposing this. God ain't do that. Like, the way he made my face, my feet don't look like that. <laughs> but I know the way my feet is set up. Mm -mm, we can't do that. I'm gonna say it in a nice way because I love you. I love y'all. I ain't gonna be mean. I ain't trying to hurt y'all feelings. You gotta know what looks good on you and what don't look good on you. When they lay a wig, when they put a wig on, all of that, they get a lot of compliments. What makes you feel confident? What makes you feel good? What makes you feel like that guy? What makes you feel like that girl? Like, what does it for you? Uh, it is, it ain't, it's not for me. Like, I be feeling confident. I be feeling bossy at times. Like, mm, that outfit ain't hit how it was supposed to. That's another crucial piece to upgrading your appearance. When you look good, you feel good. Hey, friends. Welcome back to our channel where I inspire your desire to be great. To be great. To be great. Thank you guys so much for tuning in watching another video if you are new to my channel come here welcome hey my name is christina nice to meet you to my amazing supporters welcome back to another video thank y'all so so much for tuning in if you are new don't forget to smash the subscribe button down below and also give this video a thumbs up if you like this video before we get into it it is wednesday february 8th y'all so the get ready with me part of this video, I filmed it, let me tell y'all when I filmed it, on the third. So this is like five days later, I'm getting to film the motivational part of it. And I'm really excited to do this video, y'all. I got so many amazing content coming that's about to help y'all, about to add value to y'all. Like it's gonna get good, y'all. So make sure y'all stay tuned, okay? All right, so in this video, I'm gonna talk about like up Upgrading your appearance, okay? I personally feel like, I mean, I always looked good, but baby, I feel like as I age, I just look better, okay? And I wanna help you to do the same thing. Like, you know what they say? Some people age like wine, like the older they get, the finer they get. So I want you to experience the same thing. And I feel like with that, it comes with like, just knowing how to carry yourself. Okay, one thing I always, say like people compliment me on a lot is my looks is my appearance so i feel it's only right to put my supporters on to how to like upgrade your look like i feel like you could look good and you can always look better like it doesn't hurt to get some tips and tricks on how to look better so i'm gonna share with y'all like how i've like gotten like just figured out how to look better if that makes sense so first place to start I would say like what are your best features I got my notes on my phone so I'm gonna be you know going off of there because I don't want to miss nothing baby I gotta give y'all all the tea on upgrading your parents okay so first first thing like where I started is you gotta know like okay what are your best features features okay some people it's their smile some people it's their height some people it's like the way their body is built the way their body is designed so you gotta feel it out you gotta figure it out like what are your best features so I'm gonna use my face for an example okay I can use other this things as an example but we're gonna go with my face just to help y'all out right so I know like when it comes to my face my best features are my smile and my eyes and my brows my eyebrows I have never had to like arch them thread them none of that like my eyebrows are naturally like this okay so since I know that that is my best like this this and this are my best features lip gloss always gotta be popping like the lips always gotta be nice always gotta be hydrated okay teeth baby teeth always gotta be clean so let's say like you know you probably going through it financially you probably don't have it like that which is completely okay it's like you don't have to go to the dentist all the time and get your teeth whitened and get your teeth clean baby they got toothpaste that comes with teeth whitening in it like i remember a few times like i've gone places and people have asked me like did i get my teeth done no i did not get my teeth done these are my natural teeth and my teeth are naturally this white okay 
you could use tooth whitening toothpaste to whiten your teeth especially if your teeth has a problem like if you're a person that drinks maybe coffee a lot or soda like things that causes a lot of buildup on your teeth please i beg if you want to upgrade your smile and you know let your smile look more appealing let your smile look more attractive keep your teeth nice and clean and you can use tooth whitening toothpaste that is very very helpful there's something that i have used and i've told someone like i never got my teeth done like no i did not go to columbia <laughs> and get my teeth done like no i brush my teeth nicely okay another thing your lips you always got to keep carmex on you always got to keep look on my desk is carmex okay on my beauty area no i got lip gloss for days like <laughs> i got lip gloss for days in my bag in my purse i always have at least two lip glosses why because i know that this is like my best feature this is what keeps me looking good keeps me looking attractive keeps me feeling attractive so anything that you know is your best feature dress it up magnify it and make it look good okay again my face is one of my best features keep your hair did okay ladies keep your hair did gentlemen keep your hair like nicely shaped up lined up like don't be going around looking all crazy and mm -mm, like no don't do that okay when it comes to my eyes for example right when I'm not wearing contact lenses which y'all will notice a lot I like to either have on enough mascara where you could see through my glasses that like hold on i gotta wait till the glare is gone <laughs> from the thing but anyways when i'm not wearing mas mascara i got my lashes on lashes under glasses or like having mascara on under glasses for the ladies if your eyes is your best feature like baby baby 10 out of 10 like always get compliments on that okay with my brows again because i know my brows is one of my best feature I never used to like getting up and like, you know, putting on the, um, what you call it? Putting on brow gel and putting on, um, what is that called? Like liner on your brows and all that stuff. But again, I know that this, this, and this is my three best features. So even if I don't put on a full face of makeup, foundation, all of that, like if these three things are done, my appearance is like, it up my appearance a little bit. So that's why I mean, you, that's why I say that you have to know what are your best features when it comes down to it, okay? On the other hand, how can you magnify them? Like them being your best features. Let's say your body type is a certain way. How can you magnify certain features on your body type or hide it? Like, I don't wanna, cause, <sighs> you know certain things are a sensitive subject and i don't want to be insensitive when i am talking but y'all get the point just figure out how to magnify your best features okay on the other hand what are your least best features because you also have to know that too and how can you minimize them like when you minimize i'm gonna give y'all a perfect a perfect example okay because my husband joke about this all the time and my my brother jokes about it too but according to them I, it's not a lie but it's true my head is big okay so because i have a big head <laughs> so bad saying this uh because it used to be one of my insecurities but i think i'm good now anyways but i have a big head so certain hairstyles i cannot wear there's a certain way i cannot do my hair because it does not magnify like my i don't want to magnify that my head is big the aim is for my head to look a certain size and look proportion okay so even how i wear like my curly hair for example bigger hair bigger hair fits my face fits my head because i have a big head so if you have a certain type a head head size head shape you gotta know that you gotta know like what looks good on you so i'm about to put y'all up on game how i minimize the feature of my head being big so y'all see how i lay my baby hair and put it like dramatic to the front it makes my head look smaller especially my forehead see because it takes up like so much of it so that's what i mean by knowing what's your best feature your least best feature focus on minimizing your least best feature and focus on maximizing your best feature that way when people see you see when people see me 
they don't see my big head they be like oh i love your hair yes because the baby hair baby the baby hair is stepping like they see the baby hair before they see my big head they see my pretty lips my pretty eyes my pretty brows before they see my big head okay so you got to know how to maximize like your best feature and minimize your least best features okay and we all have features that are not our best features let me tell y'all another secret <laughs> I can't believe I'm exposing this because this but these are like insecurities that I'm pretty much past them y'all I do not have the best looking feet like my feet like God ain't that was not like mm -mm, God ain't do that like the way he made my face my feet don't look like that <laughs> okay so I know like when I look for shoes my shoe game is always on point always on point and my shoe game is always on point so that nobody knows I don't got the prettiest feet, baby. Like, I I just don't have the prettiest feet. Same thing with my hands. I, I don't think my hands are the prettiest, which is why I used to get my nails done. Eventually, I'm going to go back to it, but I don't think my hands are the prettiest. But that aside, like, you just got to know what are your least best features and your best features because i've seen people like they're not aware of what their best features are or their least best features are and they don't know how to magnify and minimize them okay so certain style shoes i will never ever ever wear other girls wear them and i'm like oh my god i love those i wish i could wear them but i know the way my feet is set up Mm -mm, we can't do that okay so that's just a little tip there when it comes to upgrading your appearance another thing overall just know your features you have to know your features know what is it that people compliment you on all the time like ever since I was in probably middle school people always talked about my eyebrows like all the time like first they used to make fun of me that it looked evil blah 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 but you know they was they was just being kids making fun of me but as I got older like girls would be like oh my god your eyebrows are like perfectly arched like do you get them done where do you get them done and it's like no I was just born with them like this you know what I'm trying to say so you have to know your features know what are the features that people compliment you on the best the same thing with with my smile like everybody always tell me like I have such an amazing smile so also whatever your best features are please maintain them please take care of them don't be just neglecting like no imagine if I had like dirty teeth like that would just ruin my smile so God gave me an amazing smile. I got to take care of it. So whatever your best feature is, make sure that you're taking care of it. You also have to know your body and know your body type. Why? I feel like I'm one of the best dressed people that I know. Like I love the way I dress is because I know my body type. I know what looks good on me and I know what ooh, and I know what don't look good on me. Like certain things just don't look good on me. Certain things like when I'm putting an outfit together, I already know like I got to minimize this area and I got to maximize this area. So I'm going to talk in codes a little bit because I don't want to get like explicit in this video. There's no need to. But as a girl, I'm heavy chested and I know that. Right. So even when I work out, I work out to do my best to let my body be proportioned. Right. But even when I dress, the way I dress, I make my body look naturally proportioned as a heavy chested girl your tops have to be bigger like you can't be trying to wear tight fitted tops when you're top heavy and your bottom is not as heavy you get what i'm trying to say you got to know that about yourself as a female as a guy if you're big or you have a i'm gonna say it in a nice way because i love you i love y'all i ain't gonna be mean i ain't trying to hurt y'all feelings but i'm just trying to help y'all out as a guy if you're big if you're built like bigger wear stuff that fits you don't wear stuff that's tight that got your stomach all popping out and all that like no wear stuff that fits you nicely period i'm gonna I'm just leave it at that i ain't gonna go too far but again know your body type if you're a female you can even look up there's actually a chart i'm gonna try to find it yes you can search body type charts for females and for males and there will be a body size chart that kind of tell you okay how your body is and you'll know okay this is how my body is this is how it's not and depending on your body type you got to know what looks good on you and what don't look good on you 
of course you could do way more research maybe i'll do it in a separate video because there was i have watched like a few youtube videos in the past like to help me like just put myself together better if i may say so depending on your body type you gotta know what looks good on you what don't look good on you like and certain things you can't pair another thing like naturally for me as a girl because of how i know how my body type is the type of dresses that looks the best on me are body con dresses every girl don't look good in body con dresses they just don't you get what i'm trying to say but you gotta know your body type or some girls they look better in dresses that are like flared out you know what i'm saying so y'all will notice if you know me like in real life or even through camera because y'all see me get ready I only wear a certain type of thing consistently. Like I'll look for it in several different colors, several different styles, but it's technically the same thing because I know what fits my body and I know what my body type is. Again, when do you get the most compliments? Like I know what hairstyles get me the most compliments. I know what looks, I know what fits, I know what colors to wear that gets me the most compliment. Like for example, a lot of people love like a color that people love on me is kind of like this mustard color mustard like goldish color and whenever I wear that color people love it I think it's because the color of it brings out the undertone of my skin if that makes sense so you gotta know like okay when do people compliment you the most depending on what people compliment you on the most it's kind of like an experiment because I've had to experiment myself once upon a time but wear different things and see what feedback you get the most on what you wear and then just keep wearing that over and over again okay again when it comes to my face i get a lot of compliments on my face on my brows on my eyes on my lashes on my lips like i get compliments on that all the time on my hair i there's a certain hairstyle that's why y'all always see me like majority of the time i wear curly hair why because when i wear bone straight hair uh it's cool but i don't get that much compliments with that so i kind of stay away from that but the curly hair baby i'll go curly hair in blonde black red blue green <laughs> no i'm just kidding but i'll literally go curly hair in pretty much anything because i always get compliments on curly hair you get what i'm trying to say i've tried to like wear wigs before but i've never gotten compliments like wearing wigs just never so i stick to hairstyles that looks natural like yes th these are extensions but it gives like a natural look if that makes sense like anything that where my natural hair is left out in it i get more compliments on that so i kind of stick to those type of hairstyle now there's some other girls on the other hand baby when they lay a wig when they put a wig on all of that they get a lot of compliments if that gets you a lot of compliments then you know that's what helped to enhance your features and help you to look your best and help you to upgrade your appearance okay so stick to that now the next thing that well same thing like i was saying what's the most common compliments that you receive whatever you know that okay when i wear this or when i you know put on this type of style thing i get a lot of compliments stick to that and then your overall appearance will be upgraded rather than today you got this on and then tomorrow you got something else on like i told y'all y'all rarely ever see me do just straight hair like i don't think y'all ever see me in straight hair because i don't get compliments in straight hair for whatever reason like straight in here don't get me compliments so i don't do that and even put the compliments aside it just doesn't fit me that well i why i don't know oh i know why <laughs> i think i know why i think it's because it makes my head look big as i told y'all because i got a big head so as a big headed girl straight hair just does not go well with me it really don't but curly hair baby i can hide this big head y'all can't see it <laughs> no i'm just kidding but all jokes aside you gotta just know like based on the things that i told y'all you kind of just have to know and the last thing is what makes you feel your best that's another thing you gotta know when it comes to upgrading your appearance what makes you feel your best what makes you feel confident what makes you feel good what makes you feel like that guy what makes you feel like that girl like what does it for you like for me my baby here's always have to be laid always it just it just makes me feel good it just makes me feel my best curly hair like i said 
makes me feel my best whether it's wavy whether it's curly but plain straight hair uh it is it ain't it's not for me you know what i'm saying when i got my gloss on my lip gloss that's why i keep so many lip glosses with me like when my lips are hydrated and shiny and glowy like i feel my best now glasses on the other hand for some time they never really made me feel my best but i've learned to like let them make me feel my best like i told y'all if i don't got mascara on underneath it that like magnifies my lashes or if i don't have lash extensions on i'm not feeling the whole glasses thing but if i don't want to do lashes i don't want to do um mascara or anything give me some contact lenses and i still feel my best as long as my brows are done and as long as i got my lip gloss on like that is enough for me so you gotta know like different things that you wear that make you feel your best me i love wearing like dresses dresses make me feel my best like i'll be feeling confident i'll be feeling bossy at times like you know high heels that makes me feel my best when i'm wearing my bags y'all know i love my bags i love my jewelry like those things makes me feel my best so i wear them so you gotta know like some people they love sunglasses like and shout out to y'all y'all people that be wearing sunglasses indoor i give y'all credit because I be trying to wear sunglasses indoor and it do not be working for me. But for some people, sunglasses make them feel their best and they wear it. Some people, even if it's not prescription glasses, they be having frames on y'all. Like they be having frames on and you like, why you got frames on? You wear glasses and it's like, no, but that's what makes them feel their best. They feel sophisticated. They feel, you know, so that's pretty much the T on like upgrading your appearance. You gotta take time and just get to know yourself, analyze, reflect, and just put those things into practice. So I hope this video really helped y'all to upgrade your appearance. Again, these are things that I've done myself. These are things that I've implemented in myself. Jewelry, like I said, is another thing that just makes me feel my best. For some people, like, they gotta do the extra, extra jewelry. For some people, it's cosmetics jewelry. Some people, it's real jewelry. Like, you kind of just have to experiment and play with it and just get to know, like, what fits you best, what makes you feel your best. Like, for me, for some time, like, I was, it took me a time to build my shoe collection, right? But now, my shoe collection is like a good 40, 50 pairs of shoes. But it took me constantly like trying, y'all, I can't tell y'all how many shoes I've bought and returned them, bought and returned them because I was like, okay, I see this online, it looks good. I tried this in the store, it felt good. And then when I wear it, it don't turn out to be how I want or, you know, it just didn't make me feel as good as I thought it would make me feel. So I end up putting it back. So you really kind of just upgrading your appearance is really just experimenting and trying different things. And sometimes you're not going to get the response that you're looking for. You might not get the feedback that you're looking for. And you have to be OK with that, too, because sometimes like I'll put an outfit together and I'll be like, oh, it's not too bad. Let me try it. And then after I put it on, go out, nobody compliments me not saying that people will always compliment you when you look good you gotta remember people are moody they be in their feelings sometimes so they might not be in the mood to tell you that you look good because they might be having a bad day so you can't always depend on that either but there are times that you can be real with yourself and you be like mm, that outfit ain't hit how it was supposed to you know what i'm trying to say where you ain't give yourself enough time enough thought to put your outfit together that's another crucial piece to upgrading your appearance you gotta make time and effort like to put effort into yourself because that was originally I used to just throw stuff on and just go <laughs> and then I would be like mm -mm, I can't do that like I can't just be throwing stuff on so I do have times where like I have a fashion show at home I haven't had one in a long time but I do have times where I have a fashion show at home and I just try to put pieces together see what shoes go with this what outfit needs a bag or what outfit needs some shoes like you know what I'm trying to say and as you do that you will just naturally learn what looks better on you so I hope this video helped you to upgrade your appearance. You know, when you look good, you feel good. And when you feel good, 
you feel good like who doesn't want to feel good you know but that is all i have for you guys i hope y'all enjoy this video i think it was fun i have so many more amazing 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 videos coming for y'all so make sure y'all stay tuned i'ma roll the clip of me getting ready obviously this is not the outfit because i didn't get to film that day but i love y'all i appreciate y'all enjoy me getting ready even when you feel low you can still go even when you feel slow you can still go even when there's no hope you can still go i never answered a no man i still go 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 hustle out hustle every single day i'll be making moves till i'm buried in my grave to the system, I don't wanna be a slave I've been doing shit my way, uh, or the highway And in the driveway, is a nice range Cause I grind through the climb, I invite pain You'll never hear me, bitch, nah, I don't complain Just gotta flip the switch and you can go and obtain Anything you want, anything you need Your mind's got the key ingredient, it's belief uh, They'll see with the negativity But I just slide right by that energy uh, Even when you feel low, you can still go even when you feel slow, you can still go Even when there's no hope, you can still go I never answered a no, man, I still go Go, 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 go but even that could change You could flip the gray matter Like some batter in your brain uh, That's why they say Fake it till you make it, eh And if you play that game Then you just might make a change Rearrange all the bad to okay Take the worst thoughts and Turn them to a game Take the best thoughts and Put them on display On repeat in your brain Till you're feeling no more pain uh, Never slow yourself down You can do some more Push past all the pain And you'll find a door Open it up And finally explore Everything that you thought You could never do Slow, you can still go Even when there's no hope, you can still go I never answered a no, man, I still go Go, go but today was super dramatic because it was super cold it's supposed to be like negative three degrees tonight in new england so the outfit is dramatic today okay so this is my coat y'all my oversized jacket then i got this furry vest on hold on wait i should take my jacket off so y'all can see the whole look there y'all go and then this scarf I did silver accessory of course because silver zipper on my dress and then I got these boots on my thighs are like my calves are pretty small so they continue to slide down but that's my outfit y'all today it was given extra dramatic and nice and warm oh and this is my bag that I wore with it and your girl has some gloves on to go with it. So that's my outfit. I hope y'all like it. I lived it. And I only did my brows, laid my baby hair. And I put on mascara. I didn't do like lashes. So that's my outfit. I don't got lip gloss on right now. But that's my outfit, y'all. Super cute. Super cute. Look at that. It was given. Everything was supposed to. Alright, see y'all in the next part of the video. Alright, y'all. So I hope y'all enjoyed the clip of me getting ready and of me showing y'all my outfit. 
try different things comment down below if you have additional tips for anybody that you know want to like upgrade their appearance or find a way to enhance their look enhance their beauty just leave a comment down below so thank y'all so much for watching don't forget to smash the subscribe button on my channel and don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up and most importantly don't forget to leave a comment down below thank y'all so much for watching i love y'all i appreciate y'all and let 2023 be the year that we upgrade our appearance okay so that's all i have for y'all thank y'all for tuning in i'm gonna see y'all in the next video where i inspire your desire to be great to be great to be great bye